of our Father here, we felt it necessary to come to physically sympathize with you and I assure you of our commitment and the nation to remain together in this time of difficulty in whatever way we can. We've been to the government house and I have graciously seen the governor and I announced if not only to talking contribution of 50 million dollars. And the Almighty Allah will continue to grant you the grace to be able to stand and deal with this difficult situation and continue to bless the good people of Medjugorje, the good people of Brunei State, and the good people of Nigeria. Thank you. And I humbly invite our first presidential candidate for prayers. Do I want to cow over no? I cower the I of the people i know that you are going to do it this is the person nigeria voted for on february 25th 2023 i know that he is going to do it i told them to calm down that i know you you are the epitome of love you are the epitome of caring you are the epitome of unity in nigeria i know that you are going to do it I know that you can never fold my hand, no matter what the people are saying. Just few days ago, I overheard them on Twitter space, castigating you, Mr. Pitobi, saying all manners of things about my leader, my president, the person we all voted for on February 25th, 2023. Oh yes, we voted for him. I heard what they are saying about you. They were criticizing you that you don't want to visit the Borono people. I only told them to calm down that I know you. You are one of the biggest masculine in this side of the world. You are the beautiful bride that everybody will want to see. I know you. I told them to calm down. They were saying that you never wanted to visit Borono people, that you are afraid to visit for new people. I told them to calm down because I know you. I also reminded them and I will also remind them this night that among the three major contenders in the February 25th, 2023 presidential election, P2B was the only person that went inside inner, 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 inner Borono state among the three of them. Mind you, his party was not in power. He is not from Borono State or from the North. Atiku Abubakar is from the North. Bolaha Meditinumbu, the incumbent governor of that state, 
is from APC. But P2B never care. P2B never mind. He went with his people to inner inner Borono state to make sure that they feel his presence. You can see what is happening the moment he showed in Borono state. They remembered because P2B was there. And not that P2B just visited them. P2B was in Borono state twice. That was last year before the February 25th 2023 presidential election. Go and check. Fast check me on this. P2B was there twice. That was why when he visited, you saw how happy the people were. You know when they say um, Tinubu visited, when they said that Atiku visited, you saw people were not all that amazed. People were not all that carried around because when they were campaigning, those guys were not there. It was only Mr. P2B that went in a, in a, in a, in a Borono state. Twice. P2B went where that location that they said that they were fighting, that Boko Haram is um, occupying. P2B was the only person that visited them. That, you know, went to talk to them among the three major contenders in the February 25th presidential election. If you make a research, you are going to see that P2B won Bruno State. Yes. I told you people before now. I made a video. I told you guys that immediately P2B won Medugri. They shut down the market in Medugri. Yes. Go and make your research. As soon as P2B was announced the winner of uh, Medugri, or the winner of Borno State, they shut down the market in Medugri. You can see how happy the people were the moment they saw Mr. P2B. Mr. P2B is the epitome of unity in this country. That is why he never hesitated. You see him, the way he was, you know, giving out that money, the 15 million. Oh, yes. I know others might say they gave 1 billion, they gave this. Did it come from their heart? It never, because when it matters the most, when Borunu people needed them, where were they? How many times have your president visited Borunu State before now? How many times have Atiku Abubakar, the one that said he is from the north, how many times have he visited Borunu State? P2B is from the east. The incumbent governor, is an APC governor, but these are the things that P2B never look at. He will always tell you that all of us go to the same market, irrespective of party, irrespective of um, region, irrespective of the religion that we worship. All of us go to the same market, and that is why you saw him in Borno State, the way he visited twice last year. That was the way he also visited now. And the people felt his presence. That was why they were all happy. Because the man with good heart, the man that they voted for in February 25th, 2023, have returned again to say thank you. Peter B never started now. Because I, I, I saw people castigating him attacking him on the twitter space let me remind you guys once again because i will always remind you guys i remembered vividly in haiti when earthquake happened mind you p2b and his son we are there to support the people p2b this p2b that you are seeing and his son the both of them we are there to support the people when it happened in kogi state p2b was also there when it happened in Anambra State. In fact, P2B did something that people of that side, that part of Anambra State, up to today, they always remembered Mr. P2B of. P2B climbed the canoe without life jackets just to go and assist those people that were trapped. In fact, after attending, after visiting them, people were very angry at Mr. P2B. How can you 
How can you do such without, without a life jacket? But P2B never care about those things. I told you guys when a man that planted um, yam in his farm and then um, water came and destroyed everything. That man said he is not going to leave his farmland until P2B the governor then come and visit him. If P2B do not come, he will not come out. The water should also kill him. P2B left whatsoever he was doing. He went and visited the man in his farmland. That was when the man left there. So those people that are attacking this man called P2B, <laughs> P2B is not a camouflage. P2B don't, he's not somebody that wants to come and show or no. He does whatsoever he is doing, January. So, if you are part of those people castigating, attacking Mr. P2B, Mr. P2B is very genuine. What do you guys think? Drop a comment for me. Tell me what you think about this man called Mr. P2B.